Noah. Bible Heroes in Poetry. By Fay Column Fairly. Evil prevailed over the entire world. God was saddened as it unfurled. The beautiful world that he created was being defiled and desecrated. God knew that evil would overtake. This world it took him six days to make. His only option was destroy it all. All that walketh creepeth or crawl. Over all the earth, of all that trod. Noah found favor in the eyes of God. Noah was a just and godly man. So God picked Noah for this plan. Noah, he said, an ark you'll build. With your family, it will be filled. You will gather animals of every kind. So you can start over at a later time. Noah obeyed, and with tools in hand, constructed the ark by God's own plan. It was exact, breadth, length, and height, with window and door all done right. Noah and his family, numbering eight, gathered the animals and their mates, with food and grain for all aboard. After all were in, God closed the door. After seven days, the rains began. Waters rose up as was God's plan. For forty days and forty nights, till no dry land was in their sight. The tallest mountain, the highest hill, every inch of the earth was filled. For one hundred and fifty days, Noah and all in the ark were safe. Every creature and plant on earth was destroyed, as per God's word. The olive twig brought by the dove told Noah it was the end of the flood. Now evil prevails over all the world. God is saddened as it unfurls. The beautiful world that he created is being defiled and desecrated.